Hello! Today, I got access to the beta of Palia, Palia, whichever, I don't know. Um, so I figured I would try it out today. You know, haven't done a video in a while, this seemed like the perfect opportunity, something new and fresh. So, figured this was a good place to start, creating my person. So, let's... Let's go. <laughs> Okay. Oh, brother. I literally spent 20 minutes or more designing this person, so please enjoy this clip I sped up by literally 10,000% because I took so long. Time for you to go out into the world. Mm. I have high hopes for what you can accomplish. Okay. Butterfly. I don't... I don't really know what to expect. I really have not seen much about this. I just... saw the thing that... made me download it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Is that me? Oh. It's me. Oh, hello. Am I like in it now? <gasps> Am I scary? Good day for research, don't you think? Oh, my dragon. <laughs> did, did, oh, I hate doing this. Did you just materialize from nowhere? Um, honestly, I have no idea. <sighs> right? <laughs> you probably don't know any more about your situation than I do. <sighs> it's just none of the other humans knew either, which leads me right back to square one. Other humans? <sighs> yep, you're not the first human I've seen in po Oh, I should have looked up how to say this. Palia. Palia? Whatever. Just the first I've seen you, I've seen, you know, appear in a giant cocoon of light. Aww. We should slow down. Why don't you take this map and head into town where you can talk to Ashura, the innkeeper. He's been helping others like you get settled in. I would help you myself, but I'm working on something here and I am this close to figuring it out. I was so caught off guard I realized I, realized I forgot to introduce myself or explain why I'm here. The name's Gina. I'm an apprentice scholar researching these old ruins. And this here is why my research assistant, Hecla, Hecla, be sure you ask her if you have any questions. I've got to get back to the grind. Until next time. Okay, okay, okay. Skirt. Doing your own research. Why don't you come back with my husband in just a little less? I'm I just really wanted to make sure. Oh, hi. I literally moved before I can even move. Okay. <laughs> Good to know. Hello, Hecla. Hello, human. I know you must have many questions about your spontaneous emergence. Your presence heralds much change in the world of Palia. What am I? Who are you? Why was your friend so freaked out? Air t oh, air type- oh! I can pick? Water type personalities are thoughtful, introspective, and emotionally sensitive. While intelligent, they often tend towards melancholy. Earth type personalities are stubborn, practical, and honest, often to a fault. Air types personalities are laid back and free spirited. They never take themselves or others too seriously. I'm gonna ask who are you? I'm Hecla. It's my duty to aid and protect the young scholar known as Gina. We have stumbled upon you during a routine ex ex oh. <laughs> excavation of the ruins of this ancient human city. This occurrence comes as a great surprise to young Gina. I cannot talk. I, on the other hand, found it inevitable. You were bound to return one day. Why not today? Please return? What? Me. Oh, brother. <gasps> I'm gonna pretend it didn't just lag like that. And we're gonna continue on. What? Whoa. Skirt. Oh, I'm no longer in control. <laughs> oh.
<laughs> oh my god, I'm scared. Where can I go? Like, I know I'm supposed to go the other way, but I want to find the secret. Is this? Oh, okay. Nothing I can do. <laughs> oh, how'd they get so far ahead of me? <laughs> can I go this way? I think I'm going all the ways I'm not supposed to go. <laughs> okay, I'll go this way. Just because why is that tree? Okay. Okay. Hello. Another child of the Phoenix joins our little village. I must say today is a lovely day to be born. Ah. I'm chain the local ritual sage and devotee of maji mahi the great dragon it's my job as kill oh my god kill him as healer and sage to care for our villagers both physically and spiritually so how are you feeling i'm sure there's quite a lot to take in what is fire hello fire type personalities are friendly brave and easily excitable and natural born leaders i like this one the world is amazing I'm glad to hear it. Keep that positivity and you'll overcome any troubles the world offers you. I do not know why the gods brought you here, but I am sure there must be some great plan in store. I look forward to seeing it. Now, you'll want to speak to Ashura before you do anything else. Just take this path towards the village. He'll be in the big building with the keg out front. May the dragon be with you. Can I go in here? What's in here? Oh, it just opens. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. What? Oh. I don't know why I did that, but I did it. Okay. I, I'm sorry, I won't go in your private room. <laughs> it's pretty. I'm very confused though. I don't really know what the point is. Also, I don't know what that is up in the left corner. What way did he say to go? I'm gonna assume this way. Do I have a... B I'm dumb. I have a map. Okay, so I need to go there. Where am I? Here. Oh my god. I have a long ways to go. Tish. Good to see you. Hi. Welcome. Oh, she has a little. Hi. Welcome to the valley. I'm Tish. I run the furniture store. Are you new in town or just passing through? I just materialized from a void. <laughs> I just moved in. I'm doing this one. Huh? Well, that sure sounds tough. When my brother and I first moved in, it took us a little time to adjust, and we were just coming from one town over, not another plane of existence. <laughs> if you need help with any of the locals, don't hesitate to ask. I'm known as a bit of a grump whisperer in these parts. Bye! Hello! Oh hey, you must be new in town. I'm Nayo. My family runs the Daya farm over the west side of Kilna. If you need someone to show you around the barn or teach you how to ride a riff rock, I'm your guy. Huh. I'm also good at lifting heavy stuff if you need anything heavy lifted. Oh, oh and here's a carrot for Sugarfoot. Give her one of these and you'll be your new best buddy. Back to my work, yeah. <gasps> Who is Sugarfoot? I am suddenly so interested. Hello. Time's money. Zeki. Welcome to the general store, pal. <laughs> Actually, you look like you're fresh out of the ruins, so I guess I should say welcome to live-in. Name's Zeki. I run this here establishment. Mm. Come back when you get some cash. We'll take care of your needs. We got vegetables, seeds, fertilizer. We got that pointy stick over there that kind of looks like a rake. All uh, your best basic farming woozits and whatsits. Goodbye. We're going this way. Okay, I'm assuming it's this one. This seems like an important place. Can't... Um... I am in the right spot. Okay, hello. Have you seen my Greetings, I'm the Honorable the Kenley Bahari. The firstborn son of the late Kenjun Bahari, the 118th Duke of the Bahari province. And my brother to Ken... Oh my god. My brother to Ken Yara Bahari, the current Duchess of the Bahari province. I am mayor of this fine village and it is a great pleasure and honor to welcome you here among us. Maybe I'll take a little hello. You can never go wrong. Breath. <laughs> Looking for Ashura? You're in luck. He's literally right across the room. If you're looking for delicious soups and stews instead, I'm your guy. Ah. Name's Reth, but you can call me Troll. Ah. Stop by later, yeah? Always happy to chat with a friendly new face. I have to leave for mysterious reasons. Okay. Hello. Need anything? Ashura. Welcome to Kilima. I'm sure this is quite a lot to take in. I'm Ashura, the innkeeper at the Ormuz... Sure, horn. Unfortunately, there isn't any room at the inn right now, but we do have some old plots to the northeast where you could build yourself a tent. Mm -hmm. What do you say? You want to take the great outdoors? Um, nothing like sleeping under the stars. The night sky here is beautiful. I'm sure you'll love it. So let's see. To build a tent, you're going to need to collect some materials. I've got an axe here for you, but you'll have to talk to our resident miner, Hadari, about the pick. Lucky for you, he's checking out the plots right now. You'll want to take the road up the hill to the northeast. Here, I've marked a spot on your map. 
If you get lost, just come back here and I'll get you sorted out. By. I have an axe. Okay, where do I need to go? Uh, I have to go all the way. Oh my lord. Okay, we're gonna... And then go that way. We're gonna loop out. Then this way. We're gonna talk to you, Sifu. Sifu? Anything? Oh. Howdy, I'm Sifu, the blacksmith around these parts. Ooh. But you might recognize me as the... Oh my god, the famous monster slayer. This one. Uh -huh. Right, I suppose you c I can cut you some slack for not recognizing the most famous monster hunter in all of 12 provinces. How did a famous monster hunter like me wind up in a quaint suburban hamlet such as this? Uh -huh. Well, that's a good question. Fortunately, I have a good answer. You see, I became a mother and I realized angering dangerous beasties was, well, a little too dangerous for my young son. So I took up the position of the town blacksmith. These days, I make blades instead of wield them. Now, where was I? Makes sense. Is this the other person? Yeah. Oh no, it's not. That's an actual person. Oh no, it's not. Yeah. Oh hey, you're one of the newbies. She's cute. Look at her outfit. What? That's cool. I'm just taking a break from work. My parents made me get this job at City Hall to teach me about responsibility. All it's taught me so far is how to die of boredom. So stop back in later to keep me entertained, okay? This town needs some more excitement. Whatever. I was already leaving. Okay. Hold up. <laughs> What are those? Oh my god, I thought the sign was my ear. <laughs> Hello? Not a lot of folks come around this mm, It's coming along. A lot of trash left though. Oh hi. <laughs> Adari Pavel of Pavel Mining, what can I do for you? <laughs> hi! I'm Athena. Athena, huh? Interesting name. I assume Ashura sent you over. Been sending a lot of new folk my way lately. It's the whole reason I'm checking out the soundness of these campsites. Don't need you all buried in mud. In fact, this one's just... This one's about ready for use if you want it. Just needs a little more work. I see you've got an axe already. Here, take this pick too. Always good to have the right tool for the right job. Use them both to clear this debris, would you? Mine is hungry work, so you better take this too. My daughter says I need to eat healthier, but you'll get more use out of it. Bye. What is it? Did it. Okay, returning. Hello. What? Still lots to do, but it's a start. I found this weird thing. Huh, I found a lot of strange things in the mine, but not sure what this is. Well, you found it, so you keep it. It's your plot, after all. I've got other plots to inspect, but there should be space to drop this work table down now. I suggest you focus on getting a roof over your head and a place to keep your things before you worry about glowing tubes. Okay. Oh. oh lord, okay, um, what? I don't know where to put it. I don't know. <laughs> I guess there. Craft a wooden storage chest and craft a tent. Oh no. Okay, I need a lot more stuff. <laughs> okay, are we almost there for... Yes, we are. Oh boy. So... Does it make sense to put that there? I don't know, but it's going there. <laughs> Can I make my tent? I cannot. I need another tree. Do I have enough nail? <laughs> make. I clicked it. It's a little fishing lure. That's cute. Okay, how big is... <laughs> um, what? <laughs> oh. How's it going? Hey. Woo, good, you haven't left yet. Nope. Been chopping away. My mom, Delilah, told me there was another new human in town, and here you are. I ran all the way from the farm here. She wanted you to have this housewarming gift. Welcome to Kilima. Is that even correct? I feel like I'm reading that word too fast. And I wanted you to have your mail. I'm Ani, <laughs> and I handle all the deliveries around here. Twice a day, every day, rain or shine, six in the morning and six at night. So I think it's safe to say my job is about to get a lot more interesting. Do you like getting mail? You look like someone who would like getting mail. I love getting mail. Good, then I bet you'll be happy with what I have for you. Come on, go check it out. It's your first mail delivery ever. Gotta grab a snack. <laughs> a snack. 
Dear Athena, I have been informed by Gina that you have emerged fully formed from the swirling mist. This is wonderful news. Happy day of mist birthing to you, new human. Other humans call me Enar, and I would love to share with you the joy of fishing. <gasps> I love fishing. Please take this rod into your possession and seek me out at your nearest convenience. I shall be located at the pier for the next few millennia. Wow. To whom it may concern, City Hall requires I send these letters to new residents. You will find a bow and set of arrows in the attached package. City Hall also requires me to tell you that I am available to tutor you in their use. During work hours, you may find me in Kil Kilima Village. This is not an invitation to waste my time. I am busy. Hello. It's a good day to so, be how are you settling in? This plot is huge. I heard you can find some pretty cool stuff in the dirt. Oh, no. My dad found an old copper arrowhead in our yard last week, but all I ever seem to find are rocks. Does a weird glowing tube count? I like that uh -huh. one. Oh, wow. It definitely counts. Have you figured out what it does yet? Uh, hmm. I bet Gina might know. She's always hanging out in the ruins. You should see if she's found something like this before. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I almost forgot to... In all the excitement, I brought an... I brought a present for you too. Uh -huh. A Bug Scout's official belt and a set of smoke bombs too. I'm a member of Kilima's best and only bug catching club. I gotta run now, but if you stop by later, I'll give you some tips on how to use them. But I bet you're hungry right now. You should talk to my dad, Badru, to learn how to grow food. And Reth, who works at the inn, can teach you how to cook it. You know, everyone's waiting to meet you. Come on, I'll race you out. Gonna catch some bugs now. Bye. Bye. Leave your housing plot. Okay, I'm coming. Okay, so I have to ask Gina about the strange artifact, talk to Badru to learn how to garden, and Reth to learn how to cook. Oh my god, so they go to sleep? Can I like... Huh? <gasps> what is this? Sun drop lily. Oh, okay. Can y'all wake up? I have to ask you things, please. Please. Nothing beats dying. Well, if it produce. isn't another friend I haven't met yet. So wait, they let you like talk to them if you have a quest, I'm assuming. I'm Badger the farmer and I since we have some good uh, times ahead. Uh, uh. Did I mention in addition to farming I also do stand up comedy? Potatoes are the worst crop to harvest. They're so low to the ground they really throw out my back. Just a garden. You've come to the right place if you care it about fresh quality produce. Honestly, I'm impressed to see you going after what you want. If I had that kind of gumption, maybe I'd be doing more with my life than just making ends meet. I'm just kidding around. Farm life's great, especially if you love the smell of ormu manure in the morning. Uh, I'll admit it's a bit of an acquired taste. Tell you what, meet me on your plot later and I'll walk you through the steps. Looks like you're ready to swing by Ken Lee. He's our mayor, so he'll get you set up with a new house. Sick. I'm sorry? <gasps> I got one. What? 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 What just happened? <laughs> Gina! Hi. Hey, Athena. It's good to see you again. Did you get settled in all right? I actually found something you might be interested in. Really? What is it? Oh, wow. I can't believe it. This thing is an ancient flow battery. These were the power sources for the ancient humans. I've been looking all over for something like this. Well, I found it in a rock. <laughs> and you say you just found this under some old junk. Must be fate. I'm not really a believer in fate, per se, but this is some coincidence. It might take me a bit of time to figure out what this does. I'll send you a letter once I know something. I'm feeling optimistic. A new day means a new chance for discovery after oh, all. You've already left. Beef burger. Okay, talk to Reth. Is Reth not on the map right now? The answer is no. So we gotta do later. But it doesn't matter anyways because it's not like I have anything to cook. Since I, I have a carrot. And I think I'm supposed to give that to a horse. So we're not cooking that. Imagine it's not even a horse. What if it's like a rabbit or something being honest i'm gonna be disappointed i want to be able to ride a horse <laughs> hello oh hello well howdy sproutling howdy good to see you again spring bean this place is already starting to look different i figured you'd still be working on the setup that on setting up that tent that's some work ethic work ethics my middle name 
I like making this place feel homey. Just the right answer. I'm sure you're going to fit in here just fine. I bet you've been working up an appetite from all that chopping and mining. Well, you've got patience. Oh, if you've got patience, I've got the solution to your woes. Gardening. All you have to do is wait a few sun cycles and voila, dinner or breakfast, even lunch if the mood strikes you. I know, I know. It doesn't sound exciting, but trust me, nothing tastes better than a carrot you've grown yourself. I've got all the tools you need right here too. Go on. Why don't you drop this plot down and give it a good tail? Oh, I see your Hey, make sure your plot is on your action now. bar and select it. Pre Shush. Is this my plot? I don't know. Um, was that correct? What? I don't know how I feel about this way to do this. <laughs> That was so long. Hey there. Oh. You might be wondering what you do next. Unfortunately, seeds don't plant and water themselves. Ah. You're going to need some of these bad bo <laughs> These bad boys. Consider them a housewarming gift. Once your seeds are in the ground, go to that pond and fill up this here watering can and give that dirt a nice little bath. It might take a few sun cycles and a few buckets of water, but trust me, it'll be worth the wait. Some things you plant might have an effect on the seeds around it. For example, carrots and onions keep weeds from growing next to them. If you find yourself needing more seeds, you can pick them up as zekis. Well, I can't wait to see you again, neighbor. Th that would have been funnier if I'd given you wheat. Hmm, I gotta work on my material. Carrots! Okay, so now I need my watering can. Where is the pond? Oh, over here. I did it. Oh, stick! I love it when they do that. Oh, I messed it up. Um, okay. I... I think we should try and clean out some more of this. What do I got? Oh, dear Athena, I've been doing a lot of digging in the flow battery you found. Humans use... D bleh bleh bleh. Humans? Humans? <laughs> Humans use these to power all sorts of things you know there's this old door under the waterfall that i've been trying to open it's just a little ways past the shrine we first met at i've tried all sorts of things to get it open maybe this battery could be the key why don't you give it a try this place used to belong to your people after all you really should be the first one to check it out okay cool does it just say one ancient thing can i like open this Oh. Okay. We're going there. The fishing rods look insane. So I would just like to explain what's going on here. At this point, um, I am 100% convinced that I have to buy the onion seeds to finish this gardening quest. I was not aware that they were literally just in my overflow inventory space or whatever you call it so i literally ran around for like 20 minutes here just wasting time thinking i could go buy these when i in fact have earned no money at this point yet so it's i figured out in a bit just <laughs> this one yay okay onion seed i have no money <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, well, since we're here, let's go and find Reth. Care to try my world famous soup? Uh, what brings you over to the snack of the village? I'm gonna chat with him what? first. Gina gave me an ancient recipe, she found it. <laughs> recipe she found, it called for an egg to be buried in the sand for a few days. But it made no mention of jotting down where I said the egg was buried, so yes, I lost a few eggs somewhere by the lake. Wow. Oh, no, 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 I didn't mean to do that. Come back. What's up? <laughs> well, there you go. Learn to walk before you can swim, unless you're a fish, but I'm like 97% sure you're a human. <laughs> Why don't you start by making a campfire at your place? Once you start grilling up shrooms like a champ, we'll get you started on the complicated stuff. Okay, fair enough. Oh, if you don't want to be stuck in a tent for the rest of your life, probably a good idea to talk to Kenley next. He's the mayor, but hey, I won't judge either way. Uh oh, my soup's burning. What soup? Okay, let's go talk to the mayor. I guess it's probably gonna pull some Tom Nook type thing and be like, "I can build you a house, but you have to give me this, 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 and this, and pay me some money so then I can make you pay back even more." I lost my. Oh, good, it's you. I was afraid you were. Again. 
ish. Let's chat. Tell me, do you think I'm doing an admiral job as mayor? None of these seem very nice. <laughs> we'll do that. Thank you for phrasing your criticisms so kindly. I know I'm not naturally suited to governance, but I still I but still I do one day hope to be worthy of my role. What else you buy a house? A house and your er you're asking me? Well personally I inherited mine. Have you tried that? I wanna build my own Oh right, yes of course, because you have just moved in. The or plot didn't come with one? No matter. I'm sure we have I have the paperwork around here somewhere. Just give me a moment. Oh no, where is it? Hmm. I shall tell you what, go find Tish, our resident carpenter. I'm sure she'll be delighted to get you s started on some nice furniture while I locate these forms. I'm too famished to keep talking. I tired you that much? Okay, well, Tish is literally right here. So let's just talk to her, get that over with. Hello. Mm, I was just thinking about oh, you. Hi. Mm. I've been thinking of making a new line inspired by flora and fauna in the valley. You know, I can make a wistful willow bed frame, a faux cernic skin rug, and a stink bug themed incest burner. Okay, you're right. The last idea because you're a little work. Yep. So glad you're doing you're going to live here. I was trying to come up with a good welcome gift, then I realized a house isn't much of a home without furniture. So here's some simple recipes for you to start with if you're tired from all your hard work. Why not build yourself a place to sit or a table to eat at? My friend Jill insisted you have a wardrobe too. He's a tailor and he's always said you're looking blah, 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 says looking your best makes you feel your best. Even if there's something you can't make now, I'm sure inspiration will strike as soon as you start building. Bye. Okay. Um, we're gonna run. I wanna learn how to fish. Is that right here? I'm gonna assume so. Yep. Okay, cool. I kinda just wanna get the basics done right now. Whoa, this stuff look Oh my god. Oh my god. I didn't think you are another robot. <laughs> I just- Wow. Hello. Humans call me oh, hello. Ina. You seem to be another new person. Einar. Unless I have previously made your acquaintance, in which case my apologies for forgetting you. I am often too distracted by my own by my oneness to take notice of such things as meeting new people. And there seems to be so many new people lately. What is the oneness? Silly human, the oneness is merely the oneness. The oneness cannot be learned by listening to the sound of air as it moves through your face flaps and must be experienced. What are face flaps? For me that experience usually involves much fishing. I'm a chat first. Cernic scent Cernic tend to gather around the grassy plains. You can often find organic life near its food source. You must have received my communications regarding the beloved pastime of fishing. I understand it is customary for to require work that one does from home. I know there is a word for it, but I cannot quite recall what it is. I couldn't even say the word you could recall. Here, why don't you give that fishing rod on your person a try? I shall be here in case you accidentally fall in. You are done with your face flapping, and yet you are still here. <laughs> what? Let's go right there. Oh. I figured out how to do it. I figured out how to do it. I got it. Okay, I did it. Now what? Can I sell it to you? Do no. you wish to engage? I have crafted many fishing. adornments made from fishing implements. I find them quite aesthetically pleasing, but I do sometimes wonder if I am the only being who feels this way. What do you think of my adornments? They're charming. This pleases me. I shall remember you find my adornments charming. I caught a fish. Congratulations. I hope you were able to experience the same joy as I derived during such events. However, my time with humans taught me your kind derives limited utility from living fish. Perhaps this is a more suitable reward for your efforts. I do hope you will choose to continue this wonderful activity in the future. In the meantime, if I find anything I believe will be of interest to you, I shall have it delivered to you via mail. Good. Bye. Is that not how humans close conversations? I love him. He's my favorite. We are going to craft the campfire. I want to get the cooking one done. I'm making the campfire. 
Let's just, let's place it literally directly in the mi- Oh! I did it! Oh! 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 Oh my god. We're not gonna talk about it. <laughs> okay. Um, let's make the dining table first. Just because, to me, it makes sense to put the table down first. What? I don't- what are they? What are these? This looks cool. Log cabin log carrier. Huh? Okay, I'm gonna put this right there. I'm gonna do like in The Sims. It's fully to the cause and will gladly offer it so if you run out of firewood. Oh! No, I'm okay. <laughs> that was kind of pointless. I don't know. Oh, okay, great. Um... This one looks cool. Lock up and bookshelf. I just, I didn't need a bookshelf. I need to stop doing what looks cool. What? I like that, it looks cute. Like, yeah. <laughs> okay, we're gonna hope, do I still? Dang, hold on. I do, okay, good. Oh, a wall torch. I'll take that. Okay, now, um. Go right there. Oh! Oh! No, my girl's cute. <laughs> We're not changing that, okay. Oh. The person's at my plot, so I'll just- I'll talk to him now. Hello. Have you seen my Wonderful news! I found the forms under the bookshelf in the head. records room. They're only a little crumpled, too. If you can just sign here, here, and here, I'll be able to get you that blueprint. Yes, and here, too. Oh, and here. There we have it. And I even remembered to bring you the blueprints with me. These are now yours, Athena. I suggest you plop the frame down as soon as possible and get building. Now, if you'll excuse me, I do believe it's time for my break. Maybe I'll take a little- Yay! Okay, I now have the foundation for my house. We're gonna save the foundation for the house until next time. I do really want to try the battery on the door. <laughs> I don't know how much this is gonna progress, but I'm assuming if it it won't let me do it if I literally cannot do it. So we're just gonna try because I I feel like hopefully it's gonna look cool. Did it work? <laughs> That was a little lackluster. Hopefully it gets cooler. Oh, whoa. <laughs> what is this? A bowl with rust on the bottom. The inscription has been worn away by time. Oh, I can even see that. The original inscription has been carved over. What's left of the carving says Nev L Ving with a frowny face next to it. What does that even mean? The worn inscription says, Roots of darkness take hold from echoed woes. Our hope shall live on so long as this water flows. Is there anything else I can look at? The strange writing says, Knowledge grows the mind even in times of strife. To enter here, you must apply that which grows life. Solve the riddle. I'm assuming it's water. It's like, does it have to be special water from this place or can it just be water? Oh. Oh. What did y'all get here? Yeah. Heck yeah. Gina has been looking at the same rock for a long time. I worry about her sometimes. To better understand Gina, I have programmed my limbs so that they grow weary when I perform work over time. I now wish to turn this subroutine off. You okay, you seem quiet. We should not be here. Especially not Gina. What? Why? This, this is a sad place. I am prohibited from saying more at this time. I am sorry. Please do not ask me any more questions. I will be good to Gina. You actually did it. I heard the rumbling. It came running. 
This place is amazing. It must have some kind it must have been some kind of temple. Can you actually read the carvings on the walls? This is ancient human writing. Actually no, that makes perfect sense. You're a human. Of course you can read your own language. You scout ahead. Hecla and I will survey this room to see what we can learn. Okay, is there anything to look at on the wall? Doesn't look like it. The inscription on the base says, Dear Phoenix, protect this place and its people. Let your waves wash away our blank. <laughs> the final word is too faded to read. Holy. I feel like I'm in Tomb Raider. Okay, I'm assuming this says something. Yeah. This chamber was added for your protection. Do not give up your faith. The king shall free us when it is safe, and our people will roam the land again. Okay. What? Hi, I'm back. Oh, I hope I didn't freak you out too much when I clammed up. I just never witnessed an actual human reemergence before, and this whole thing is just a lot. You know what I mean? It's a lot for me, too. <laughs> ha, you're right. I guess appearing out of nowhere would be a lot scarier than just watching someone appear out of nowhere. You're an archaeologist? I wish. Right now, I'm just an apprentice. I'm doing my thesis on human reemergence with the hope of becoming a full scholar. So if you see any interesting artifacts you need examining, go ahead and send them my way. They might be the key to me becoming a full scholar. Or, you know, the key to discovering the mystery of what happened to your people. That second part is obviously a lot more important. Forget I said the first thing first. I found something up ahead. What is it? Some big ruins. A ruin? Intriguing. Perhaps this was a temple. I wouldn't try navigating that area without a glider. You'll need to speak with Najima about building you one. She usually hangs around Bahari Bay. Cool! So, it looks like we're gonna be flying. Okay! This game intrigues me. I, I still don't really know what direction it's gonna go in. Like, I don't know if there's some funky thing that happened in the past that we're gonna have to go and like fight or whatnot or if this game is truly just like a chill like game where you just learn about stuff like okay well i'm assuming the main point of this game is learning like why the humans are like coming back and whatever because it seems like the humans used to live here something happened that i'm assuming is tied into those ruins and then i still don't really know what these people are like if they're for lack of a better word trolls <laughs> or something i or like i don't know i don't know i don't know what they are completely and if they said it i totally missed it and that's my bad <laughs> but either way i'm sure i'll find out soon i could definitely see myself getting addicted to this once i actually know what's going on but i think we have a pretty solid start at the point like we don't have our house yet but i got it and we already have a thing where it looks like i'm gonna be able to fly so that's pretty sick but yeah, I'm gonna leave this here. We got introduced a little bit, started some things, got a little foundation going. And next time we we will see what else we can get into. But until then, whatever I named this girl, Athena Andromeda is signing off. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you liked the video, go ahead and like it. And if you really liked it, go ahead and subscribe for more of Palea. I think. I'm gonna settle on Palea. That seems correct. But I will see you next time. Bye!